What is going on, fellow outlaws? Outlaw Gary here, and what the? Hello? Oh my god, it's missing an antler. It's talking to me. Hello? <laughs> dude. Whoa! What? <laughs> Whoa, dude! What the heck, dude? That was so rude! He didn't have to do all that! Oh, man! <laughs> <laughs> What's going on guys? Hopefully you're having a fantastic day. If you guys are new around here, hit that subscribe button. Um, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to drop a like. I did not expect that was going to happen, but it was freaking hilarious. And today we're showcasing some of the strangest burial sites and ritual locations in Red Dead Redemption 2. Starting off with one that many of you guys may not know about, and it's actually really close to Fort Riggs. Now, here's the thing. I have personally never been to this location in Red Dead Redemption 2 because I've noticed that a lot of things that you may find in Red Dead are super off like course they're not like on your normal path and really close but look at this dudes this is a super random grave that you can find in red dead redemption 2 that has some really creepy markings on it now when i first saw this i instantly thought okay is this an indian tribal burial location because it sort of looks like one but i don't know exactly what it's for or why it's here a lot of times in red dead redemption 2 we have a lot of backstory to what happened or what caused this uh death but around this area there really isn't anything here but it just shows you it's a really nice spot now i thought this spot was like eagles flies from the story in my current playthrough i think his name is eagle flies i'm not like in i'm not very far i don't i don't know like who this would be and why this grave is here. Cause you gotta think about it. Someone took like someone at Rockstar as a developer created this art and they implemented this in the game. There's gotta be a reason, right? I don't personally know what it is. If you guys know in the comment section, please be sure to let me know because I wanna find out. Now there's a few others I wanna take a look at. And one of them is one that you may be familiar with due to our interactions here on the channel with it. Of course, we're talking about the Pagan Ritual Site. The Pagan Ritual Site is one that leaves us with many questions than answers similar to this one. And it seems like a lot of these ritual sites or graves are unmarked and very, very just confusing. I don't really know what the Pagan Ritual Site's used for just yet, but I do want to try something, actually. I don't have Molotovs. I was told recently, now thinking about it, if you throw Molotovs at Indian graves, it causes a lightning strike. So wait, let me try that real quick. Is there any fence nearby? There is not a fence nearby. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to jump over to Strawberry real quick. I'm going to fast travel to Rhodes, and then I'm going to buy ourselves uh, some, some Molotovs, and then we'll be right back. So let's do that real quick. All right, my dudes, we sort of have, we, we had a little bit of a war wardrobe change as you guys can see i had to load back a different save that had enough money so that we can buy some molotov cocktails but we have re-arrived as you guys can see it's currently daytime let's see what happens oh i lost honor for it it started raining dudes it's legit it started raining no freaking way no freaking way holy what what wait what if we do it again will it start like thunderstorming it's it's what it's actually getting darker out too oh my god that is i thought it was just a myth i didn't think it was legit everyone's like oh garrett like you throw fire on an indian grave it starts raining look at that that is freaking cool learn something every day dude learn something every day okay now we gotta save the rest of our fire bottles because the next two locations we're gonna need it for one of them. And this location apparently 100% causes something crazy to happen. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to wait. We're gonna have to do that on the last one. So stay tuned, let's go to the next location. And I gotta say dudes, that is a super oddly placed rock. This rock is so weird. These things are looking like straight meteors over here. Now, there may be some non-believers out there that are like, oh, Garrett, it's just a coincidence. It actually happened. Like, that was legit. Let me try it one more time, all right? You guys can see it's not raining, right? It's clear as day, no rain. Check it out. You know what? Maybe, <clears throat> maybe it only happens once. Does it only happen once that it starts raining? Wait, the fire instantly goes out now. Wait a second, that's weird. Why does the fire instantly go out? Oh, shoot. Okay, we gotta get out of here. The Indians are gonna kill us now. Way to go, Garrett. Always messing up stuff. Now, I don't know if this is true, but if you find all the Indian graves in Red Dead Redemption 2 and you set them all on fire, that might lead to a chain event of something 
happening like a mission or an easter egg or something with the indians taking place somebody wants to try it let me know because that sounds like a freaking cool video all right listen i know that i said i was gonna save this one for the last one you know what I'm not going to go back on my word. We're going to save it for the last one. I can't do that to myself, all right? I said I was going to save it for the last one. We'll save it for the last one. I was super excited to show you guys this one, but I'll be back, all right, Indian people? You guys just hang out there. They're sort of dead, so I know they're not going anywhere, but I'll be right back. All right, we've arrived. Now, this location I've showed off more than most, I think, just because it's extra creepy, and it's so creepy because of the music that plays. You guys can hear it. It's like some really weird howling thing. Yeah, I'm not really sure what the sound's for, but this location, if I throw a fireball at it, nothing really happens. Like, it doesn't start raining. Nothing really, like, comes from it. Holy, that looks crazy. Let me just... That looked nuts. Holy moly. One thing I've actually never tried to do is, like, light the candles on fire, but I feel like that's a stretch. Regardless, you can inspect the corpse and you can grab the mask. Now, this is also weird. People say that the reason why this is here and not anywhere else is because it's the opposite side of the lake. Whereas you guys may know... Wait, if you... Oh! Dudes, if you set it on fire, you can't grab the mask. Oh no. What have I done? Hey, give me that. I broke the mask. That's crazy. Did you guys know that? If you burn the mask, it actually burns it where you can't use it. My God, I've been here so many times. I didn't even know that. Can I shotgun it off maybe? No, I can't do, oh my God. By the way, I feel like if you shot a shotgun, on, on a horse, you'd blow its ears out. So that's a pagan ritual site. Let me go check one more time. Maybe like it just bugged out. I'm gonna try to use my horse. Oh, shoot. Give me that freaking mask, you a-hole. Give me the freaking mask or else. Yeah, it's stuck. It's like I melted it to the dude's face. It's pretty nuts if you think about it. All right, the last site. One of the most interesting of the three, which maybe I should have even made for its own personal video, but I've already promised you guys this thus far. Guys, they're arguing. Hey! What do you say about my sister? That's right. Now, you know what's weird? These guys are really close to the pagan ritual site. I feel like these guys would make a perfect sacrifice to them. But he just killed, wait, I think that guy's only knocked out. I don't think he's dead. Oh, no, he's dead. Now you're coming with me, brother. You're coming with me and you can't say anything about it. This could get bumpy. We have entered into the native burial site. Now, this location, which by the way, I don't know if I showed you guys on the map where this is at. It's over here in uh, in Big Valley, West Elizabeth, up next to Strawberry, and the pagan ritual site's over here. But as you guys can see, the pagan and the, and the Native American are directly across from one another. So I think that has some resemblance to what's going on here. But what's crazy is when you throw fire, I believe it's here, lightning strikes down. But there's only one way to tell. So, sir, we're going to have to use you as a test dummy. Here we go. Weather's normal. Holy, look at this burn. <gasps> it's raining. Oh my God, this is the thing. It's actually raining. Oh, the Indians are freaking pissed, dudes. The Indians are freaking pissed. Oh, people of the Indian tribe. I'm sorry. Why am I talking like this? <laughs> now, when it rains, it pours. Now earlier, what? Oh, what? Did you just see that? They were pissed. Oh, I am freaking dead, dudes. The Indian people are gonna come from the bushes and freaking kill me. Oh, dope, look at this. <gasps> dudes, it, it, it wasn't a Native American uh, burial. Look, that's the same marking. That's the same thing. Oh my God, I am a freaking 200 IQ genius, dudes. So for the Native American location at this spot exactly, you actually get this hatchet right here that I have in my inventory, it's a tomahawk, from online GTA 5 or GTA 5 online. So I bet you guys didn't know that. Maybe you did, but still, I thought it was pretty cool. When I first played the game, I found it just randomly walking around. I was like, holy, I'm a freaking genius. So check this out. I'm gonna try this one more time and see what happens. I don't think it'll burn again. Oh, it is raining again. What? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta say, this is pretty freaking cool. How? If you guys enjoyed the video, new round here, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed it, drop it a like. That was, this has been fun. This has been a really fun video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed watching. It is a little weird and 
creepy, but Oxar has thrown in all these rando randy things in here that, uh, whoa, what is this? What the heck? What does that mean? This is a, this is a tombstone. This is like a grave. That didn't work. I really thought something would happen there, but it didn't. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. This has been super crazy, spoopy stuff. And this wind, dude, look at there's even a thing here. What is this? I'm telling you guys, there's, oh shoot. There's something to the story here that we're missing hundred percent. I bet if I came back here at like 2 a.m. or something crazy and threw the fire and like did some kind of recipe, it would freaking, man. Holy. All right. I'll catch you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. It's been a crazy day. Later, guys. Oh.